kept them off the coast. That's why we've been having these high thin clouds. Makes for pretty sunrises and sunsets. This is going to be pretty harmless. It's going to continue to bring us some clouds into tomorrow. Cold weather though breaking out in the Gulf of Alaska is going to break away and head down the coast. And this weather system looks like it's going to arrive Tuesday. So let's pick up future cast at 3 p.m. Monday. So again, this is tomorrow. Any travel plans looks good. Heading to the Bay Area, the Sierra, everything is fine. We get into Tuesday morning. Cold front comes through. I think this is our best chance of rain for the valley. The snow will start developing in Tuesday morning, and it will continue off and on, likely into Tuesday evening and overnight Wednesday. I think Wednesday, we might have a leftover chance for a valley shower, but I think a lot of Wednesday is dry in the valley, but the snow will continue in the Sierra. May even come down a touch below 3,000 feet. There's a chance we're going to get a of snow, even in some foothills locations. So, impacts this week. Most of the valley rain will fall Tuesday, but it's going to be under a half of an inch of rain, mainly more like a quarter to a third of an inch of rain. Foothills, we're calling for rain on Tuesday, some showers left behind on Wednesday. The question is just how low that snow gets. And then, snow is in the forecast for this year on Tuesday. A good steady snow, and snow showers will continue on Wednesday. So, those both days, you really need to be ready for winter travel heading into the Sierra. Highs today, though, in the 50s and 60s. In the mountains, 63 in Pollock Pines, mostly sunny. 68 in Jackson today, and near 70 in Sonora. The foothills beautiful this afternoon. Same thing in the Delta, upper 60s to near 70. It's mostly sunny with light winds. Highs will range near 68 in Manteca, close to that in Tracy and Lodi this afternoon. We'll be in the upper 60s in Davis, about 70 in Folsom and El Dorado Hills. Just a little tick cooler tomorrow with a high of 67, but still again mild. Tuesday, the temperatures plummet to the mid 50s. Wednesday, after that little bit of rain on Tuesday. Tuesday, we may have just a leftover shower in 53. And then Thursday for Turkey Day, that turkey is shivering because we're in the low 50s, morning temperatures near freezing, and Friday morning could actually be even a little colder. It'll be brisk still on Friday with a high of 54. Leticia out.